What's going on guys? It's your boy Danny Mangan here back for another video. Now I'm not looking to completely destroy YouTube's algorithm with this video gain 1,000 million subscribers. Um, the point of this video guys is about you guys, okay? It's about you guys watching me right now, okay? It's not about me, it is about me. Some of the things I'm going to talk about I'm going to apply in my new year. Um, and I want you guys to apply because obviously I don't just want to be that YouTuber who films their lives Documents everything that's going on about my life and doesn't help you guys. I want to help you guys. Okay, this isn't just about my life I want to help your life. I want every single boy girl Dog cat granny granddad to be able to live the best life possible. Okay, so don't just think I am here to you know, I, I, I just want so much more for you guys as well. It's not just about me. I, I want to motivate you guys. I want to help you guys have great lives in any way, shape or form. And that's why I'm making this video to help you guys. Because I had this on my heart. I've literally, it's Sunday the 5th of January. I've just got back from church. And I was like, I want to fire everyone up. I want to get them gas. I want to get them feeling happy, motivated, ready to go into 2020 and completely hammer it okay so that is the point of this video if you're new to the channel subscribe we have so much content coming this um coming this year coming this month coming this week we're going to amsterdam next weekend and best believe it's going to be lit but for now guys subscribe if you're new like the video share this after you've watched it share this video with someone that needs to hear what i'm about to say let's do it okay guys so the first thing i want you guys to think about is happiness now personally i want you to think about all the little things that make you happy okay because a lot of people take for granted what they actually have so for me first of all it's a new year i want you guys to wake up every morning or every other morning as often as you can and give yourself three things that make you happy if you've watched my channel you know i talk about this a lot um but i want you to wake up and find three things that make you happy small 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 things okay so for example it could literally be the ability to go downstairs and have fresh water out of the tap, okay? By doing this, guys, you're gonna create a mental, uh, you're gonna put yourself in a positive mindset, okay? Not only are you gonna do that, you're gonna, you're gonna actually, you're gonna appreciate everything you have a lot more. You're gonna show gratitude for everything and it's gonna put you into a mindset because a lot of people focus on what they don't have to compare to what they do have and then they get really upset about it, okay? Second thing is I want you to think about all the things that make, all the things that you do that can make you happy, okay? So this is a bodybuilding um, YouTube, bodybuilding YouTube channel, fitness YouTube channel, vlogging, whatever, whatever you want to call, right? You know I go to the gym. You know I love bodybuilding, okay? So for me, it's bodybuilding, gym, and church. They and my family. They are the the three thing, four things that make me really, really happy, okay? And spending time with my friends. So. I can imagine some of you guys and girls watching this have very similar interests to me. You love going to the gym, you love your family, you love your friends, you love training, whatever it is, but some of you might be different, okay? So find out the things that make you happy, okay? It could be going to the club, it could be going to raves, spending time with friends, going to the movies, whatever it is, and I want you to really implement, and you probably are ready, but continue implementing these things into your life. So basically do more of what makes you happy, okay? Surround yourself with your friends and that makes you happy, whatever it is is okay the next thing i want you guys to go into this year with is the ability to set your goals okay so you need to set goals for the year now don't set something stupid you know i can't just go i'm gonna win a miss olympia 2020 you know because it's not gonna happen you know and then i'm gonna have un you know what should we call it i'm gonna have unrealistic expectations of myself which are going to cause massive problems so what i want you guys to do is set realistic goals okay so personally my goals for 2020 right and i'll tell you my realistic goals we are currently at nearly 1600 subscribers on youtube um we are nearly at 3000 followers on instagram we are potentially about to start prep for a bodybuilding competition my realistic goals would be I want to finish this year with one thousand. Sorry, I want to finish this YouTube year with five thousand plus subscribers. I want to finish my Instagram year with ten thousand Instagram followers, and I want to, depending on how things go, I want to win my bodybuilding show, and and then potentially in the other category in the other federation, I want to place top five. Okay, so these are all goals that aren't unachievable. If I work hard at all three things, I know I can achieve them with my, with my work ethic and my um my ability to just go heads you know tunnel vision i know i can make all of these things come to come to pass all right so just please pick some smart goals that you want to achieve if it's it can be literally 
this isn't just aimed at gym people, guys. So don't think it is. You know, if you're a if you're a chef and you want to do, you want to upgrade your promotion. If you've got a job and you're looking for a promotion, if that's a smart goal for you, then set that goal. It's not all about gym. It can be life goals, whatever it is. But set small goals. What's this going to do, right? It's going to keep you focused. It's going to keep you tunnel visioned on those goals, so you don't lose sight of what's going on, right? So, for example. If I know I want to hit 5,000 YouTube subscribers by the end of 2020, then I know I need to post videos. I know I need to work hard. I know I need to find fun content. I know I need to be, you know, myself on camera. There's so many different things I know I need to do. But what it will do is it will motivate me to keep on doing what I'm doing to get to my goal. Because a lot of people will go into 2020 with no goal, no vision, and then wonder why they're not getting to where they want to be. I want you guys to go into 2020 with a goal set, okay? A goal set and in small chunks. Do it month by month if you can't hack it. By the end of January, I want to do this. By the end of February, etc., etc., etc. So set your goals. Wake up in the morning and be positive. That's the two things that are probably the biggest things of how you guys can have a good year. Really, honestly, think about it. Goal setting and happiness. Those two things, I really honestly feel you can go through 2020 in a really good place. Okay, third thing I want to speak about on how you guys can have a good 2020 is your surroundings, the people you're around, which obviously can fall into friends. I want you guys to surround yourself with people who are like-minded individuals like yourself, okay? So for me, I'm very lucky at the moment, I'm surrounded by people who are like me. They're, you know, they have the same vision like me, they have the same goals like me. You know, they're not necessarily acting like me, because I'm, I'm <laughs> don't worry. But, um, you know, they have... They're, they're good people who bring benefit to my life in a positive way. I want you guys to do the same, okay? So, for example, I've got two great friends at the moment, Jamie and Dan. They're both bodybuilders. They both want to take over the industry. They both want to get massive. They both want to compete. They both have goals. They have ambitions, okay? Um, they're doing great things on their own, and, you know, they have very similar mindsets to me. And what's this going to do? It's going to propel me and them into a higher realm, okay? So be very careful and cautious of who you surround yourself with, people, because there's a lot of people out there that will just hold on to you and try and pull you down. Um, so surround yourself with a good support network, a good friendship group, and I believe you will do really well. Don't, you know, don't think about how many friends you've got rather think about the quality of friends you've got because I'm not I'm not gonna lie my circle is very 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 small right now but the people I've got in it are very very high quality I actually finished 2019 by losing a lot of people and I'm talking a lot of people I lost my relationship I lost my friends my old church I lost all of those friends okay none of them reach out to me anymore and I'm not going to go into that but my point is surround yourself with people who want to see you do well. They don't judge you, you know, they just care for you, they're positive, all of that stuff, okay? So surround yourself with like-minded individuals who bring positivity to you. Um, this is a massive one. Let go of 2019. So whatever has happened in 2019, and, I, I, and guys, remember, I take my own advice, okay? I'm not just saying this to you guys because I'm not trying to... You guys have to remember, I'm not perfect. I'm, I've done stupid things. I've had bad stuff done to me. You know, I don't mean to sound... That's, that sounds drastic. But the point is, we've all got stuff in 2019 we need to leave behind, right? So leave it behind. Completely leave it behind. Focus on 2020. Because if you don't focus on 2020, then guess what? When the end of 2020 comes and you still haven't left 19 behind, guess what happens? You then drag 2020 into 2021. So focus on 20 fucking 20. Focus on it. Stop her. Uh, leave 2019 behind. Whatever it is. Relationship problems. Leave it behind. Breakups. Leave it behind. Um, shit job. Leave it behind. Whatever, whatever it is. Whatever is on your mind and coming. And my, It's only January 5th. So we're literally only into 2020, guys. What I want you to do is completely sack off 2019. Completely sack off. Go into 2020 with a fresh mind. A fresh heart. You know positivity mindset and you will do really well don't drag any baggage into 2020 re re please don't do that because it will just really can my seat go down it's pretty high no <laughs> sorry that ruined my flow it will really affect your 2020 guys so please just go into 2020 with a fresh mind a fresh heart open-minded positive vibes a great circle of friends and Remember, guys, I'm just here to bring positivity to the channel. That's all I'm trying to do. I'm just here to bring you guys a smile. I'm here to motivate you guys. Remember, like, we've all got dreams. We've all got ambitions. We've all got goals that we want to get to. And everything is possible. I honestly believe a lot of people, and this is, this is the motivating part, a lot of people, for example, footballers, right? A lot of or bodybuilders, a lot of people, and that footballers a bit more, a bit more realistic, 
in my honest opinion, there are talented footballers. There are people that are talented at what they do, but anyone, in my honest opinion, could, could be Cristiano Ronaldo. You know, if they start young enough and they're prepared to work as hard as he did, I honestly believe you can you can become one of the best footballers in the world if you apply yourself at a young age. So if your dream is to be whatever it is and you honestly believe you can do it, apply yourself. Get in there and work your arse off. Do whatever you have to do to achieve that dream. You know, there's going to be people that are doubting you. There's going to be people that are saying you can't do it. There's going to be people that are telling you you're stupid. You're being, you're being a mug. Whatever it is, if you honestly believe that you can achieve something and you believe that you're set on this planet to do a certain, a certain sport, a certain activity, then go head to the wall after it. And whoever doubts you, let go of them. Just go balls to walls towards your goal, okay? You could be watching... I know so many people who could be watching this and they want to be a YouTuber. I want to film my life. I want to document it. I want to help people. Pick up the camera now and go make a video. Go do something. Document your training. Do something. I hear so many people go, oh, do I have what it takes to be a YouTuber? Find out. Find out. Pick up the flipping camera and go make a video. Pick up the camera go make a vlog. Help someone. I know so many people that want to be a bodybuilder. Well, get a diet plan. Coaching, I'll put a description. If you, if, you, if you guys do want coaching or some sort of online coaching, training plans, diet plans, email me. It's in the description. I'll help you out. If you guys want to change your physique, yeah, or you want to lose weight, or you want to build muscle, or you want to fit into a wedding dress or suit, set your goals and get them done. It's not impossible, guys. It's really, really not impossible. Find, like, I'm so, so motivated going into 2020. By the end of 2020, every single goal I have set will be completed. Because I'm so scared of failure that I'm going to make sure whatever I set as my goals, I will achieve them. Because there's no way I'm going to 2021 sitting on January 1st thinking, oh, I fucked up. Oh, I didn't do this. I didn't do that. I didn't do this. I didn't do, do not let that be you. Do not let that be you. Do not wake up on January 1st, 2021 and go, oh, I didn't do this, 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 I didn't do this. Don't be that person. Because guess what? Then another year's gone and we're nowhere near close to the goal. So find the goal. If you want to be the best burger flipper, practice flipping your burgers. If you want to be the best bodybuilder, fucking start bodybuilding. If you want to be the best footballer, start playing football. If you want to be the best person, you know... You get my point, guys. Find out what you're here for, your purpose, your calling. What makes you happy will probably bring that to you. So, you know, bodybuilding makes me happy. So, you know, I'm going to be... That's my goal. I want to be a professional bodybuilder. I want to be an IFBB pro, and I'm going to make it happen. Probably not this year, but one day it's, it's going to happen. Okay? So look at what makes you happy and your passion and where your passion lies. That will most probably give you an indicator of what you are meant to be on this planet. I've had it in my heart for ages. I've honestly had the vision of being an IFBB pro set in my heart and my mind for years and years and years and years and years. Okay? And you guys watching this have something of your own that's in your heart and in your head and that you visualize every day. So use that as the fire. Go after it. Don't stop for anyone. Do not stop for anyone. But that's it for the video. That's how you guys are going to have a great 2020. Remember, there's only one shot at this life. There's only one shot. I hope this video is not meant to go viral. It's not, it's not meant to blow up and get seen by 1,000 trillion gazillion people. But if, if this helps two people on my YouTube channel change their mindset, change their lifestyle, whatever it is, I do not care. If it's two people who I've helped, that is the point of this video because I'm here to help you guys as well as me. I want you guys to have a great year as well as me. We're a team. It's just Team DMAC, baby. And I want every single crew member to have the best 2020 ever. So one day, I want to meet you guys. I want to meet all of you guys. And you guys tell me how this impacted you, how you changed your mindset. That's the goal. I want to hear your stories. I want to hear your victory. I want to hear your victory stories. I want to literally have you guys come up to me and go, Dan, I watched that video and it changed my life. There's so many people right now who message me on Instagram. I posted something on my Instagram. By the way, if you don't follow me, it's Danny, Danny Mangan Fitness. I posted some... Um, you know, a message on my Instagram. And so many people reached out to me saying, thank you for your positivity, great message. And that's what I want. I want you guys to get positive messages because there's so much negativity in the world right now. So that's why I've made this video. I hope it's fired at least one of you guys, all girls up to have a great year, to leave everything behind, to switch on the positivity and to just go into 2020 full blast, ready to crush it, baby. Ready to crush it and to take no mercy. Subscribe if you're new. 
like the video. We're going to Amsterdam next weekend with Danny Maskell. It's it's gonna be a mazza. I love all of you guys. Thanks for the th th thanks for the support on the channel. Even though I've been ghosting half the year, but there's no more ghosting now because we have to achieve the goals. Follow me on the Instagram. It's just Danny Mangan Fitness. Details in the description. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. I will see you guys next week. Peace.